Uh, we're open sourcing the first set of our Llama 3 models at 8 billion and 70 billion parameters. They have best in class performance for their scale. Will Meta take over the position of OpenAI? Llama 3 is here and it's shaking up the AI world. This open source model's like nothing we've seen before, unlocking a whole new level of AI capabilities. Mark Zuckerberg dropped some major news about it. According to him, Meta's on a mission to make the smartest AI accessible to everyone. Llama, Meta's new open source AI model that's about to turn heads. Llama 3 is Meta's latest brainchild and is set to revolutionize how we interact with AI. Meta is beefing up their AI game with real-time knowledge from Google and Bing, making Meta AI smarter than ever. And get this, they've made it super easy to use across all of their apps. WhatsApp, Instagram, Facebook, Messenger, you name it. Plus, they've cooked up some cool new creation features, like animations and high-quality images generated on the fly. Well, Meta's not just in it for themselves, they're open-sourcing Llama 3, sharing the AI with the world. And trust us, this ain't no small fry. Llama 3 packs a punch with 88 billion and 70 billion parameters, giving even the big guys a run for their money. I kind of think that people will probably want the AIs that they interact with. I think it'll be more exciting and interesting if they do too. Well, Mark's got us all ears with his talk on benchmarks, and trust us, it's a big deal. So we can see the benchmarks right here. Meta's Llama 3 is turning heads in the AI community with these benchmarks, and for a good reason. When we take a closer look at these models, we're talking about top-of-the-line stuff here. Now here's where things get really interesting. Claude Sonnet, a heavyweight in the world of large language models, was thought to be unbeatable. But guess what? Llama 3 swoops in and takes the crown surpassing even the most established models in the game. With its 70 billion parameters, Llama 3 is proving that size does matter, and in this case, bigger is definitely better. Llama 3 is consistently outperforming competitors like Gemini 1.5, Pro and Gemma, showing that Meta is truly at the forefront of AI innovation. In comparison with other open source models, Llama 3's pre-trained performance surpasses not only these open source but also closed source models. Let's take a look at the numbers. The Llama 3.8 billion parameter model outshines competitors like Mistral and Gemma, completely dominating in terms of performance. Even the 70 billion parameter model outperforms Gemini Pro 1.0 and Mist's 8x22B model, which is quite surprising given Mist's recent release. See, Mistral operates on a different level. They drop open source updates seemingly out of nowhere without much fanfare or pre-announcement. It's a treasure hunt. Find the download link, test it out and see how it stacks up. It really shows their agility and innovation, especially considering they don't have the backing of a mega corporation like Meta. Sure, Meta has billions to throw around, but Mistral's ability to compete at this level with limited resources is truly commendable. Now let's talk about the training data, which is equally fascinating. People are always curious about what goes into training a model. Well, Llama 3 is pre-trained on a whopping 5 trillion tokens, all sourced from publicly available data. What's even more impressive is that this training dataset is seven times larger than what was used for Llama 2, and it includes four times more code. And to gear up for multilingual scenarios, over 5% of Llama 3's pre-training data comprises high-quality non-English data, spanning more than 30 languages. However, it's worth noting that they don't expect the same level of performance in these languages as in English, which makes perfect sense. As we've always stressed, when it comes to training models, data quality is paramount, as demonstrated by smaller models like Orca 2 and Microsoft's F1.552. As we wrap up, all of us are probably left with one thought on our minds. How might Llama 3's multilingual capabilities shape the way we interact with AI on a global scale? Do drop your thoughts about this in the comments section below. And if you've enjoyed diving into this topic with us, don't forget to show your support by smashing the like button. Plus, stay in the loop with all the latest updates on the industry by subscribing to our channel. Until next time, stay awesome, keep pushing the boundaries of what's possible, and we'll be back with another one soon.